Well, antibody treatment for COVID-19 is now available at the Jacksonville Main Library Conference Center. Last week, we told you when Governor DeSantis announced this new site, on your side, Satya Collins is there live now. She's been speaking with people who received the antibody treatment. So Atia, I know the center just closed for the day, but how was turnout there? Well, I did talk to a couple people that were here. Patients entered and left through these doors behind me on Main Street after receiving that antibody treatment. Now, no prescription or referral is necessary, and those I talked to are pointing to this site as a potential great tool in the fight against COVID-19. Jacksonville's new antibody treatment center is a potential lifesaver for those at risk of severe complications from COVID-19. Well, if it wasn't for that, who knows where I would be. Daniel Cano and his mom, Shenny Graham, who run an assisted living facility, brought their clients here for treatment, a proactive step against potential hospitalization. And feel like we're not waiting for residents to get sick, but hopefully prevent them from, from truly getting ill. The monoclonal antibody treatment is offered at the center for those 12 and older. It is recommended for those who tested positive for COVID-19, were exposed to the virus, or within 10 days of symptom onset. Patients coming in for treatment should be at high risk for severe illness, hospitalization, or death from the virus. The lab-manufactured antibodies could prevent COVID-19-related hospitalizations or emergency room visits, according to the Food and Drug Administration. The Jacksonville Main Library Conference Center is the new location for the city's antibody treatment center, an important therapy as local COVID-19 cases surge. I'm glad that the city is doing it and we have about 160 residents and we will bring them even if it's one by one, but everybody needs it. The Jacksonville Main Library is offering the Regeneron antibody treatment. They're open from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Monday through Sunday. No appointment is necessary, although you can register online. Reporting in Jacksonville, Tia Collins, First Coast News, on your side.